Hi guys, here's how you can enable your Samsung Galaxy S3 as a Wi-Fi data hotspot. Uh, this will enable you to connect to the internet uh, using the data connection on the phone uh, and use it with your laptop or perhaps another phone or some other device. So what we need to do uh, to enable it is go to settings, then we're looking for more settings, click on tethering and portable hotspot and you will see portable Wi-Fi hotspot. It's currently turned off, but we'll go into the settings first before enabling it. Press that. Uh, down the bottom here we have configure. And right here is where we configure the SSID. So you give it a name, so it will be, uh, you can recognize it from another device when you want to connect. Uh, you can give, you can hide the, the device um, so it's not visible. Uh, you can set security, WPA2 PSKs, which is what I've selected. Uh, password you will put in and um, if you scroll down here if you forget what it is or you want to reset it just click on show password that will show it once you've set these um, options just click save and you can go back and what we'll do now is enable oops what we'll do now is enable eventually the portable Wi-Fi hotspot so that is now ready on the Samsung S3 and what we'll do now is go over to my laptop and connect. On your laptop enable Wi-Fi that may be a switch on the side of the laptop or a key combination. Then look for the network icon on the taskbar, click on that and it will pop up your available networks. Now you can see AG that's actually my Samsung Galaxy S3. So what I'll do now is right click on it and go to properties. Okay this pops open this box here. Um, Security is WPA2 personal, encryption AES, and the network security key, which I put in there a little earlier, um, which I'll show characters, matches the network key I put on the phone. So if you're not sure, check the phone, uh, and you can show the characters there also. All right, once that's done, click OK. You can then go back to the network icon, click on it, and it says connected. And just to test that, we'll go to Google. com, and voila, we have the page. So I hope that helps you out, and good luck. Thanks for watching. Bye.